when good morning everybody hi uh, look where i am i seem to be spending a lot of time in this house lately yeah, um you said you don't like your own home yeah it seems as if uh, oh, my, sister, go yet. my sister okay so my Honey. sister okay so my sister was at the fenty Honey. event yesterday Honey. and uh, they gave her the most sickest uh Goody bag. Bag. it's got everything it's got the bomb the melt the lipsticks it's got the foundation the kilowatt highlighter thank you mrs fenty and uh that's the girl look at how hot she was i'm stealing this one she's got two so oh. <laughs> this is the smallest one but it's a fill it will lead to see i think it's a fill you attach it to this i think you attach it to one of these oh. so you yeah what? <laughs> I'm, I'm, i ain't even finna lie i'm typically not really jelly when my sister gets goodie bags but the fenty i am jelly for uh but outside of that we are here. We are actually on our way to, <laughs> but uh, on, an, on a very, very exciting lighter note, I'm here because my sister and I are headed off to the Makanda National Arts Festival. So, in case you don't know, how to fetu tonalen na, the arts festival is actually the Grahamstown Arts Festival. But because now la hupo la kari changes tako Eastern KP name changes, it is now the Makanda arts festival look at these glasses what are we gonna what are we saying about these glasses this is my airport fit yeah understand get all on my sister's beautiful big mirror right now my sister and i are both wearing black what's new and um we're really really excited we're waiting for our uber driver hashtag our dad to come pick us up and drop us off at the airport i was hoping that he would be here now so that we could get to the airport and maybe have breakfast before we take off that would be nice um but i'm very excited since i was in monash back in my varsity days i've always wanted to go to the national arts festival so this this uh, I'm really excited and thank you very much to my sister for making me her plus one but uh -huh. also thank you very much to Standard Bank for making this happen for us this is so so exciting thank you Standard Bank thank you to me thank you to me oh, I said yeah. but thank you to me thank you <laughs> thank as an arts lover oh shucks we need to book the, the thing did you see in the email yeah. we need to book where now I'm going to go to the airport I'm going to go to the airport I'm going to no, to put, uh, Msaki, Msaki is performing and also Lil Lady Scully. She's doing visual Who's that? art. Who's that? Wow. Hey, yeah, yeah, that will be fun. Uh, so I'm really hoping that this weekend I could get to see Lady Scully and Msaki. For me, that would be great, but there's also a bunch of theatrical uh, productions as well. So I'm really so excited. The arts lover in me is so. It's caking! It's caking! Um, so right now we're waiting for dad to come pick us up. Hopefully we can get to the airport with a little bit of time to spare. My phone is ringing. Ah! Yeah, that's dad. That's dad. I can put you in the first place. Hi dad. Papa's gonna take my house. Re I'm gonna take my house party hack. Yeah. Roe met. Yeah, we're ready. Papa can shop a house parts. Okay, shop. One item pull parts. Shop. Bye. Let me tell you, your father is at a coffee shop up here. Crema. He's at the coffee shop. He's just like, just having a sport of tea, and then I'll come pick you up. Yo, yo, when a sport of tea, yeah, it's in my kind of like, <laughs> Flights oh. don't wait for oh. people. <laughs> Flights don't wait for people. No, but we've got, we've got, we've got a couple of hours to kill, so it's fine. Um, no, no, what time to fly? You do. At ten past ten. Oh. As long as we're at the airport by, by nine. nine. Yeah. Don't put my dad in the vlog. I, Papa called me ne, and then his picture appeared on my YouTube video and someone commented, oh, yo, your daddy died. <laughs> <laughs>
so we've officially landed at the PE, Abeja, the airport. Really, really exciting times. There's a lot that's about to be happening. Really, really looking forward to it. Exciting times are about to hit. Uh, and uh, yeah, just in front of me is Toby and Naledi. That's Toby and Naledi. And uh, yeah, so the flight was pretty good. The flight was smooth. It's probably really loud here and I'm not sure if you can hear me. But the flight was good, very, very smooth. And uh, now we head. The sisters are sistering. The sister. <laughs> Okay, so we've essentially been told we're getting the cars right now and then we're going to make our way to our stop where we're going to be staying but we're going to stop first at a place called Nanaha and this place apparently has the best roasted bread and pies and they are suggesting that we stop there and, and try out the food so we're definitely going to do that probably before we check into where we're going and then I think we'll have about an hour to kill before our first show, which is a theatrical production called Pumla something. But I'll tell you all about that as soon as we get there, okay? So, yeah, hey friends, Naledi is driving. There she is. Yeah. And uh, we're on our way to Nanaha. So we had a great flight. The, the flight was really good and we were reading in the flight. Yes. So now we are on our way to Nanaha farm stall. Apparently they've got some great pies and some broodies. So we're excited for that. And then after that we'll make our way to Graham's town. So we're really I excited. Know Graham's town was so out. Yeah. yeah. is with uh, Standard Bank here at the Nanaka Farm School and it's, it's wonderful. It seems like everything has been set up and uh, we're here for a spot on lunch. We're going to eat some food before we make it uh, over through to... What is this? Where's <laughs> All right, so we're here and uh, we're just doing a quick pit stop before we head out to Grahamstown. Uh, we've got a couple of shows that we've booked for this afternoon, my sister and I, and then some more shows that we want to book for tomorrow as well. So the whole purpose of it is to get in as many shows as we possibly can. Um, and we're really, really excited. Really, really 
excited um, for the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? So in the meantime, we've got some snacks for the road uh, because it is a little bit of an hour out and we haven't had anything today to eat. So we're going to, we just have some snacks, some juices, lots of water, that kind of thing. And uh, yeah, we're going to kick off. We have arrived at our accommodation. We're staying at the Cornerstone Manor. Right, let me show you. Let me show you. There we are. Um, so we're staying at the Cornerstone Manor. Um, so we're here to kind of drop off our books, bags and stuff so that we can uh, settle in a little bit before doing all the things that we need to do. Um, but yeah, you can see me. It's golden hour. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Yes, look. Oh, hey, chaps. Come on. Ah, where's mine? I don't know. They put check oh. there. Check there under there. I'll tell you now. You didn't get a line. Got or maybe you took no, mine. No, I didn't. I Got didn't. you took mine. I didn't. You can take it. No, the, those bags are still not with them. Yeah, got or maybe you will hold back in. Uh uh. So we've just arrived at the monument in Grahamstown. We're coming here for a quick tour before we do our first show for the weekend. The, the show is at seven. The show is at seven and then dinner is at eight. Okay. So yeah. We perform in Shrek musical. You, you put, oh, yes. we, per, we, we perform in Shrek musical, guys. Oh, no. Okay. When when is Shrek musical? I think it's Thursday. Uh, we're not sure. Yeah, when are we? We're the, the second last show. show. Hi guys. Okay. Do you know when the show is? No, we're not. You're not, we're not sure yet. Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck, guys. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great one. Um, thank you. Okay. Uh, Thanks, guys. Twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock.
of like who, mostly yesterday after a discussion that I had, like maybe where do I fit in into this indigeneity? Mm. Mm. Maybe I don't quite fit in either. Maybe I am not from this land either. And um, growing up on the land, eating off the land, mm. being of my grandmother's blood and um, being always very inspired by my land. Anytime, I'm a visual artist and these ideas that I get there constant me. Does not even speak the language I speak. Does not think the way I think. So they want to help me, but in their culture, in their way, and that's okay. They're trying their best, but it's not good enough for me. So what do we need? We need, we need educators, we need, we need social workers, we need, we need but our education system is so behind that we, we're not gonna make it. There's dropouts. People come out of secondary don't know how to read. Mm. How the fuck do you want them to be the country? Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Suicide is because of the cut. Yeah. And everything that trickles from it. Yeah, so. <laughs> It's been a hell of a day. I haven't been able to vlog much, but uh, we just came from a play, a theatrical production called Alapi. Let me tell you something. If there is ever a play that I have seen in quite a while um, that really tugged at my heartstrings, that made sure Hore, I feel it from the, the, the core of, of me, within me, it's Alapi and it basically follows it's a quiet visual art theater production that follows the lives of the inuit. thank you that follows the lives of the inuit people that live on in the far north of canada in the quebec area and oh no 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 it's facing me <laughs> it's facing me <laughs> um so it follows the life of the people who live in the far north of the Canada area, which is the Quebec area, and uh, their stories, the quiet life of the people of uh, the Inuit community. And let me tell you, if I could tell you how personally affected I was by it, because, uh, because even just watching it, you could see how, you know, what's been, what's been, um, communicated through the, 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 the theatre play, the play itself, is how colonization has played such a huge role in the lives of so many people, including the Inuit, and how it's changed everything from their culture, from their tradition, to the loss of their names, to the loss of what they know. And um, I can tell you, I could relate to that being South African, colonization, and what's happening to traditions and cultures and trying to preserve culture and tradition and it was fantastic i cannot tell you how much i loved it i i cried i cried um but i'll, I'll i took a little bit of a clip um and i'll put this in here so that you could see this was after the play obviously we cannot shoot when when it's still going on but this was after the play and we were having a conversation with um the the uh, the people who were behind the production and i was just absolutely floored but anyway let me go inside there uh, we're at an eatery right now the name of this eatery is we got a uh, Frasier's, Major Frasier's coffee bar and eatery. Let's try it out, shall we?
Uh, so it's the final day before we fly back to Joburg. And uh, Sunburner. Hey. And uh, that lady's talking to herself, as always. But uh, we're on our way to the Standard Bank Media Office team just to see if we can score some coffee because, man, it's cold. Uh, but we're leaving today. Our flight is at. Uh, what time is the flight? Yeah. I guess she's gonna be here for the whole week. Ah, that's so sweet. I'm a Lunala Sokodi, Sakahul, Labatung, Lisiana La Camoli. Ah, yes, Nina Sokoli, Samara. What is this crying business? Oh, can no, no.